Welcome to this edition of Meet the Mustangs. I'm Mike Rouse. Joining us today is one of Western New Mexico's golfers, Ben Skinner. Welcome to Meet the Mustangs. Pleasure, Mike. Well, you're in your third year here at Western New Mexico, and you come a long way. Does it kind of feel like you're coming home in a way? Or are you getting used to being here? Yeah, definitely. It's been uh, it's been really good because when I came out, obviously there was three more of us, mm -hmm. so all the English guys stuck together, and it's been easy to settle in. You kind of commiserate yeah, <laughs> a little <yeah>. bit. <laughs> Out in the sunshine is not too bad. So tell us a little bit about your hometown. How does it differ from Silver City? Oh, well, uh, I'm from near London, so I'm used to oh. a big city, but I'm actually in a small village, so it's not that different. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, small feel, you know everybody sort of thing, so similar. What's the weather like? <laughs> not, not as good as here. It's raining <laughs> back home all the time, but yeah. easy to play golf. So what's your biggest highlight in your college career so far? Um, uh, not too sure, to be honest. We had a couple of good tournaments. We had that run last year where we won three or four in a row, so mm -hmm. that was nice. Um, but we're looking to do some, something a bit better this year. You know, a few changes this year. What do you guys expect among the team members? I know what Coach Beatty says, but... <laughs> yeah, no, it's really promising, actually. We're obviously a smaller squad now, mm -hmm. but uh, I don't think that makes us weaker at all. I mean, had a good start, won the Cactus Thor, and last week when we played in San Antonio we were in a good position and unfortunately let that one slip but as long as we keep putting ourselves in positions where it's ours to win or lose mm -hmm. then I think we'll have a really good year because we won't make the same mistake as last week again. That's good. Yeah. Why golf? What got you into golf? Actually just completely by accident. I moved house right next door to a golf course and lived there for a few years and just decided I might as well play in the summer and got yeah. kicked out of the house. So. <laughs> just to go and play, so I played and loved it. I wish I started it sooner. But well, it's certainly doing well for you. What other sports do you play, if any? Um, I'm a big rugby fan, so oh, yeah. I don't tell coach that, but I play sometimes out here. We play touch rugby. And, uh, any sport, really. The whole team's really athletic, so we play football, racquetball, whatever it is, basketball. Yeah. So I've seen you out on the tennis courts a couple of times. Tennis courts as well, yeah. Yeah, yeah it's good fun. So what are you studying? Um, business management and marketing major. So when you get on the professional tour, you know how to manage all that money. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. That's, yeah. <laughs> so what are your plans after college? What have you uh, actually, about? I'm in the middle of applying to law schools back home in London. I'm going to go back there and do all that and then see where it goes from there. You're going to keep golf as a high priority, I'm sure. Yeah, uh, yeah. I mean, I've heard it's pretty useful in all sorts of business. There's no doubt stuff, about so it. <laughs> I'll keep going. Probably more deals made on a golf course than in the border. That's what I've heard, yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, we wish you the best of luck both individually and as a team. And we want to see another championship and national appearance. Yeah, that's the plan. Cheers, Mike. Thanks. Thanks.